Hello everyone, welcome back. I am by Moonman, and today we're gonna be having a look at this mower that's on the mod hub. It's called Nova Cat A10 CF by Potinger. It costs sixty-two thousand, and you can find it right here. It's in the mod hub in case you want this, and we're gonna be comparing it to these two. These two combined cost 61,000, so 1,000 short of the mod version. But the mod version does have a little bit more width than this one because it's 8.4. And... But how does it compare? Basically, this is the stock, these two are the stock versions. And you can basically hook this up. To your trailer and then you can hook the smaller one here basically so you can basically have these two one in front of the other and then you can use the other end of the truck like the back end so you can have a wind rower or a tether or yeah that's basically what you can do for the mod the you don't really have this option because you can only hook this up on one end. <laughs> and what is it like? Basically, it does give you a bunch of options that are really useful. Like, you can actually choose what kind of swath you want. Like, do you want to drop all the grass right in the middle? So you don't need a wind rower, you can do that. This is on the widespread, so it's gonna be going everywhere, and then you can have it just in the middle. And the right and the left, you can actually choose that. But it does come with the downside of not cutting right in the middle. So if you care about the middle, this might bother you a little bit. So I'm gonna leave this right here. And now we can hook up the stock mowers. And just like I said, this is what it looks like. And then what you can do is, you can basically hook a wind rower right in the back. This way your grass will be on a single row and it's going to be easier for you to pick it up with a baler later. Na, 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 na. This is farming sim physics. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna be moving a little bit this way. There we go. We can. Put you down, you can go down, both of you can. Okay, both are on. And as you can see, I'm mowing all of the grass, I'm not leaving the middle, like with the modded version. And the tether is basically making a really nice row for me. And. You can get this for a thousand bucks less than you can the other one, but with the modded version, you basically get a, a tether for free because you can choose to just have the grass being dumped right in the middle. Personally, I like to take a loan out so I can have both of these in front 
and then I can get a, a tether. Just because, um, I think you can say I have a little bit of OCD, but I hate leaving the small patch of grass right in the middle. I don't know, it, it just bothers me. And another quick comparison. You basically, in all the swap modes, you leave this. It doesn't really work, it doesn't really mow the middle. But if you hook the stock ones, one in front of the other, and have a tatter on the back, this is what it looks like. This is because the tatter didn't really go through there. But yeah, this is the comparison between the modded mower and the stock ones. Personally, I'm going to be using the stock ones with a stock tatter. I feel like that's a better option for me. What are you going to do? Let me know in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I also stream on Twitch at twitch.tv slash I will be playing Farming Sim this weekend, if you want to stop by. And I also should have a link to my Discord in the description down below. Again, thank you very much, and I'll see you guys real soon. Bye-bye.